Ready to move to the rhythm of merengue? This vibrant dance is perfect for the beginners, offering a fun and easy way to spice up any party or social event. Compared to bachata or salsa, merengue's basic steps are very easy to learn, so let's get started. Merengue's moves resemble walking, but with a key difference. To prep for turns, practice lifting your foot slightly as you step side to side and bend your knees like this. So imagine swaying your hips right left to the rhythm. So it goes something like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. This gentle sway is a foundation of merengue. Merengue, like many Latin dances, thrives on a fun interplay between partners. Today, it's all about who you dance with and not who leads or follows. Still, there is a basic lead-follow dynamic. The man typically initiates the movement and the woman responds with a touch of playful hesitation before following his lead. So, they create this charming back and forth. Let's practice this. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Focus on the leader's forward step while counting the music. We don't count the follower's back step to keep the rhythm flowing, okay? Don't get confused. So like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now let's practice the backward step in a stationary position. It's similar, a gentle sway of the hips from the right to the left. When the man approaches, step back with your right foot like this and count. As for your arms, forget about complicated movement. Just let them swing naturally like they would when walking. Focus on mastering the basic steps for now and we'll add arm styling later on. Now that you've mastered the back and forth, let's explore turning with your partner. When your partner leads a turn, here's what you do. In this step, we continue with the basic rhythm, altering between stepping forward with the right foot and then stepping in place, swaying from side to side. Keep following the swing and rhythm of the dance. Without crossing over or stepping forward or backward, we focus on our basic step and execute the turn almost on the spot. So let me demonstrate it from the back so you can practice at home. As the main approaches, we initially resist and step back. So it goes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Then we stay in place without moving much like this. In the advanced video with a partner, you'll see this step more clearly and understand how it flows in the dance. Well, that's it for today. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to leave us a like and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. And until next time.